everybody. Our next guest is a Tony-nominated actor and hilarious comedian who returns to the big screen as the outspoken and outrageous wedding planner Anthony in the eagerly awaited Sex and the City 2. Say hello to the very funny Mario Cantone! Everybody wait for you. Well, and see what we do. If you don't mind, we'll take a shot. We're gonna show you what we got. This steam pipe valley. This steam pipe valley. Gotcha. Uh, yeah. I can't believe yeah. you framed me with the theme song <laughs> from my children's show, Steam Pipe Alley. Uh, come on, we had to. Yeah, you, you remember it, huh? Uh, it was one of my favorite things. It was on a local, like... It was, it was Channel 9, WWO. Does anyone remember Steam Pipe Alley? It was... If you, well, for those of you across the country, it, 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 it was this... It was, our, my target audience was 8 to 15. Yes. And I had a 52% adult audience. So I had prisoners from Newark Prison <laughs> writing me fan letters. And, and it was this... And I watched this now, and I go, I got away with... Do you remember some of the games? It was in an amazing... Because here's why I liked it, because it definitely wasn't for kids. Oh, my God, no. <laughs> we had games like Find Sammy Davis Jr.'s Eye in the Pie. I am not <laughs> kidding you. <laughs> I swear to God, I was like, hey, man. And every week he lost it a different way. I was like, you know, this week Ella had a high note and Kapawi, my eye, <laughs> flew into the cake. And the kids were like, grr, grr, grr. They had no <laughs> They put their idea. hand in the bed trying oh, to find it. I found the eyeball. They had no idea. It, it was ridiculous. And then we, we, and every, every Mother's Day we had the Mommy Dearest Obstacle Course. I'm not kidding you. You're joking. I swear to God. <laughs> I had a producer named Bob Ward. I, I loved him. He gave me the job and he let me do whatever I want. And I did, Mommy Dear, she, I was like, can we do the Mommy Dearest Obstacle Course? And I would get in the, I, would, I, was, I was like, all right, run for the wire hangers. Run. <laughs> Hurry up, Christina. He was like, I'm Jeffrey. I'm like, you're Christina. <laughs> oh, my God. They were props to me, the children. <laughs> they were props. Merely props, and by the end, uh, merely props. Merely props to me, and by the end of the, I, I'll tell you, by the fifth season, my executive producer was like, you know what? This show's starting to look like a Far Island cabaret. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it really, it really did. It was, oh it was really sick. And, and I hate kids. You do? Oh, I hate kids. You do not like kids? I do not like the children. <laughs> I can't bear them. I just, I'm sorry. I mean, who has kids? And you know how hard it is, don't you? That's why they don't get offended, because the, yeah. it's people that don't have kids that are like, oh, the children, save the children. Uh, 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 every time I'm on a plane, there's a screaming child next to me. Every time I'm on a bus, it's... Br I, 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 you know, I, my, a lot of my friends have had children, and... I, I was I was hung over on tequila one day and and I don't even drink tequila and I, and I was like he, and, I, and my friend came over with her child and I forgot and this kid very cute but like a Tasmanian devil she had pizza grease on her hand she was going for this canvas like shade this lampshade I was like that's not oil proof I was like what and then, I swear to, and then and then she was going for this vase that I had and I'm like that's Versace I was a lunatic and then she's under this glass coffee table going like this peekaboo. Peekaboo, and I was just like, <laughs> I can see you, it's glass. Oh, you're the worst. Oh, oh, come on, hide and seek. Uh, hide and seek. It's fun. Call, call me when your peekaboo technique gets better. <laughs> oh my God. Or you can have a conversation about a Broadway show. <laughs> Uh, no, I, I, gosh, I'm so happy you're here. I love you. Now, you I adore you. Are, I'm you so are happy so to funny. be here. You, I, I've seen you perform. Uh, now, you're doing theater shows now? I do. No? My, after my one Mitch show, I, I, I take it around once in a while. Laugh Whore was Laugh the name of it. Laugh Whore was the name of it. It was so uh, great. Uh, I loved it. Laugh Whore. It was a fun show. Tony nominated. Yeah, Tony nomination. It was, it was fun. And, and I, I, I just played San Francisco for the first time ever. How oh. about that? <laughs> the first time. Amazing. Oh, the, the gay boy was a little late, you know. I mean, you know, <laughs> I'm not. But it was, it was, it was thrilling. And I'm, um, I'm gonna do um, Austin, Texas, June 5th at the Long Center for the Performing Arts. I can't wait. And I'm going back home in October, October 2nd at the Wilbur Theater. I know it's a, a long time. You're going to Boston? Gigs. Yes, I am. I, I don't work that much, Jimmy. I, I don't. I, I like to. I like my downtime. You do. I do like my downtime. Well, gosh, you're so funny in Sex in the City, and, and that is. I mean, you it's, become icon status. I yeah, would say. I, I guess I, I'm international. Yes. I am. Uh, international. Uh, and every time I go somewhere in Italian, they're like, Anthony! And I'm like, oh my, it's weird. I go to Ireland, and... 
That was the worst it? Irish accent. No, that's ever. a great Irish accent. Hunter and her. Yeah. Hunter and her. Hunter and her. And, uh, and the premiere was the other night. It was really. Radio City Musical, it right was out there. Insane. It, it was, was riots. There were people looting it, out of my office. I'm telling you, it was so crazy. And, and fifth, you know, we get let, let off 51st Street to get on the red carpet. And they're allowing these city scene buses to go down. And I'm a lunatic in a car. I am really like, I'm a yell. I'm like Faye Dunaway in the back of a cab. I am not good. I'm like, drive! <laughs> Go around the bus! <laughs> Why do you defy me? I'm, oh I'm a gosh. lunatic. I'm like, go, and, 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 and then the buses had big pictures of the girls. You know, the, the, yeah. have you seen the poster? It looks like they're gonna jump off and sexually molest you. I mean, it's like, wow, <laughs> they're coming off the dunes. It's in 3D. Oh, yeah. it's really in 3D. But it, it was, it was. We had a good time. You um, got. And I heard that you didn't bring your ticket or something once you I got lost, out. I lost. I, 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 I forgot my on? ticket. I, I, what, what do I say to the guy? I'm the gay guy. He's like, which one? They, they don't know. <laughs> Uh, yes. Uh, well, you had a big moment in this movie. You, the gayest wedding ever. You get married. I get married. It's so gay. After shooting for two weeks, I went out looking for a vagina. I was like... <laughs> I was like, really? Oh yeah, it was fun. <laughs> you know, it's everybody knows you. Liza Minnelli is in it. And, Liza Minnelli uh, is in this movie. She's incredible. She sings single ladies, and she nailed it every take. She sings Beyonce single she ladies. She sure does, and, and it's it's amazing to see her do it much better than Alvin and the Chipmunks and the Squeak. Will I have to say? Because <laughs> those three homos, they couldn't really. Come <laughs> Wait out. a second. No, you, they're, you're saying they're. Oh yeah, they, and then you know their agents. They're going. You cannot come out of the closet. There'll never be another Squeak. Will again. <laughs> Well, Alvin's straight, but Theodore and Simon, big gay boys. Oh, my God. Are you sure? I'm positive. Really? Yeah. No, no. Uh... <laughs> gay chipmunks, everybody. <laughs> the, uh, the movie's packed with uh, uh, cameos. Besides Liza, you have uh, Miley Cyrus. Miley Cyrus is in it, yeah. We have a bunch of people, so we have a clip we of do? the Miley Cyrus oh, clip. Oh, okay. Let's Sex and City let's 2 take clip. Let's take a look at that. Samantha looks smoking hot. Is that just maybe a little young? Uh, maybe. Mother of God, she's wearing the same dress as Teen Queen Miley Cyrus. I know what's gonna happen, but I can't look away. It's a red carpet, Hindenburg. Awkward times two. Oh! Oh, it was a pleasure to be here. It was, it, was it was really lovely to be here tonight. And, you know, I'm, I've, I've, I've been working a lot, and I'm exhausted. As you know, I do like my downtime. So I'm going to take to the road, Jimmy. You are? I'm taking to the road, and I advise you all to, to hit it. This is what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Travel my way, take the high.